Very good morning, dear children, and welcome to the new academic session. This is Mrs. Mariam Jo, and we are going to learn about sentences today. So let's begin our grammar. Sentences. Here we have a definition which we are going to understand first. A sentence is a group of words that makes complete sense. A sentence always begins with a capital letter and ends with the appropriate punctuation mark. I have two examples for you by which we can understand it more clearly. Let's begin with the first one. Who is this boy? And the second one is, this boy is my neighbor. Now, Let's come to the definition once again. A sentence is a group of words. Now, see here in the examples, we have group of words which are arranged in such a manner so that they may give you complete sense of it. Now, next part is that makes complete sense. And then we have a sentence always begins with a capital letter. So, as you can see, we have begun both the examples with the capital letter. And then it says, it ends with the appropriate punctuation mark. We can also see the appropriate punctuation marks are mentioned here. So, this definition is very clear to you with the help of examples. You would be thinking, what is the purpose of a sentence? The answer is very clear. The purpose of a sentence is to greet someone, to ask questions or to express wonder or surprise and even to give advice to someone, give command or it can be a request also. After understanding the definition of sentences, now we have four kinds of sentences. The first one is assertive sentence, then we have imperative and exclamatory and the last one is interrogative. One by one we will see them. Firstly, we will understand about assertive sentence. A, a, a statement which says or states something. Now, what does it mean? It means that it gives you the fact and it also let you know about someone. These are plain and simple sentences. It always begins with a capital letter and ends with a full stop. Now we have two examples here. We will read them. First one is, I like watermelons. Second one is, Joy is very happy today. You can see all the things according to the Assertive sentences which are mentioned here. Now we will come to the second one and that is imperative sentences. An imperative sentence requests, commands or gives directions. This definition can be understood with the help of examples. One by one we will see. First example is switch off the fan. Now, when we will read this, we will understand that this is showing you certain command. Means the command is being given to switch off the fan. Now, the next example is, please come to me. The word please itself suggests that it is a request made by someone. So, this is one example of requests. Third one is take the medicines regularly. Now here it gives you direction or suggestion to follow something. So these three are the examples of imperative sentences. Our third one is exclamatory sentences. An exclamatory sentence expresses a strong feeling or emotions and ends with an exclamation mark. 
Now, here we will see this with the help of examples. What a beautiful picture it is. And second one is, hooray, we have won the match. In both the examples, we can see certain emotion is being expressed. Here is the expression of surprise. And here you can see, hooray, it shows that it is a happy emotion which is expressed here. And it is written that it always ends with an exclamation mark. And this we can see. It has an exclamation mark either at the end or in the sentence. But exclamation mark is must. Now let's come to the fourth one that is interrogative sentence. An interrogative sentence asks question and ends with a question mark. It means it asks direct question and is always punctuated at the end with a question mark. Let's see the example based on this. The first example is, what are you doing here? Second one, did you meet Mr. Verma? As you can see, both the examples have question mark at the end and also they are beginning with the capital letter. Let's revise the lesson once again. We have understood in the lesson the definition of sentences. That is a sentence is a group of words that makes complete sense. A sentence always begins with a capital letter and ends with the appropriate punctuation mark. And we have also learnt about its four kinds. They are assertive sentences, imperative sentences, then exclamatory sentences and interrogative sentences. I hope this much is clear to you. And the remaining part of the lesson we will learn in the next video. Thank you.